Hello everybody and welcome to my e-lesson. I'm your guru and today I will teach you how to create a pie chart. Well, first of all, let us see what is a pie chart. When we go to the insert tab in Excel, we will see this chart examples. This is a pie chart. Pie chart are usually used to display the contribution of each value to a total. Use it when values can be added together or when you have only one data series and all values are positive. Similar example we have taken over here. We are trying to show the contributions of individual models of phones towards the overall sales in a mobile phone store. So BlackBerry is selling out of the total percentage. The sales of BlackBerry is 20%. iPhone is 34%. Galaxy S3. 25% and HTC 120%. Now this is hypothetical data does not does not reflect anything <laughs> in, in, in general in real life. <laughs> All right. And uh, uh, now how to create a pie chart? Well, it can be created in two ways. First way, very simple. Just select the data for which you want to create the pie chart and click on pie chart. Click on 2D and the pie chart is already ready. See, all we need to do is just look over here that Blackberry is represented represented by this color. iPhone is represented by this color. And you can simply actually choose to click over here and get the names and percentages mentioned inside. That is one way. Let me delete it. Simple how to delete it. Just click on it and press delete. The other way to insert a pie chart is select a cell where you want to have the pie chart. Select the area and just a cell and then click on pie chart 2D. The pie chart would, uh, would the, the, the placeholder for a pie chart would appear but not the pie chart. Why? Because we have not selected the data. So we would do a right click within this and we'll click on select data now this dancing ants you see <laughs> so all we need to do is just select the data from here and click enter from here you can choose various layout types see Pick and choose the one you like, the one that suits you. This is something that I really like. But my all time favorite is this one. It shows the name and the percentages very, very clearly. You can actually alter the size by dragging these three, the, 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 these buttons, you see, three, four buttons, one, two, three, and four all right and you can actually also change the colors used in this pie chart something to suit your own need see <laughs> there's so many options best ones are these 3d types these are also very very good and also these one with the black background though they, they look very cool well i hope you like i hope you like this video so until the next video this is your guru signing off for the day until then keep on practicing this you can download this file at www.myelesson.org so this is your guru signing off for the day have a wonderful day ahead happy learning